All right, guys, I know this trailer came out a few days ago and you've probably seen it five times already. I've seen it at least like 10 times. It is, let me know in the comment section if you agree with me, the best video game trailer ever. I don't think there's a trailer that I've seen that has just excited me about the game, been entertaining, been a freaking just all round clever, um, marketing piece of material to make me want to play the game like this trailer brought back memories it looped round to the beginning great storytelling and it's just all around just fantastic at showing and hyping me up for battlefield 2042 um like i said let me know if you can think of a better trailer down in the comment section i'm sure there is one fine i'm hyped up i know you've seen it before but i just thought we'd go through the trailer together and just watch it and then talk about it so if you're like me and you just want to talk about battlefield drop a thumbs up and let's get on to the freaking world's best video game trailer man i'm really hyping it up there all right let's whack out the volume this first bit oh my okay as soon as i saw this i was like yes this is what i want to see doof, 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 doof. oh man it's so good i got to turn this up for myself oh Oh, the so stuff's going down. I was like, oh, no, no, no. Little thumbs up. This is great. Look at that. <laughs> he just absolutely got planted, man. He just, <laughs> just oh, thumbs up, friend. No, dying in flames of fire. Flames of fire, ball of fire, death. Man, that was a pretty good start. At this point, I was sold. I was like, all right, this is a good trailer. Let's go. Let's do this. man and then whoop. what wingsuit you got a wingsuit in the game music great trailer and then we got the robotic dog with a cannon on it and then the music was like Mum. oh man it's kicking out we got some great okay i want to pause it here this by the way, it was freaking awesome because we had lots of particle effects. I know this might be CG and this might not be reflective of the actual game. But Battlefield's got a pretty good track record of not overselling the game in terms of uh, putting way loads of graphical effects in the game and then not delivering on them. So I kind of give them a pass on this. But there's so many visual effects. Smoke, lighting. Uh, later on, it looks like we've got ray tracing, which is kind of predictable. But at the same time, it's good to confirm it. For this, the music was pumping, like, tanks, it was awesome. I was in. By the way, I'm just going to rewind it five seconds here. Okay, look at these cranes. You know I'm going to climb on those cranes and try and snipe you. I'm going to be that guy who's up here with a sniper <laughs> trying to get that ding. Here's our first look at what I assume is kind of a levolution or level changing mid game. So this is obviously two sides and then suddenly there's a gate so people factions can fight over this section. This is pretty cool. I'm assuming that's what it is. And yes, you can absolutely get slammed if you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. And this is cool. I really like this. So this has a real cargo ship level from call of duty modern warfare love that map it was the best but what this what this section of the trailer for me was really exciting for one it's at night which is interesting and two there's a lot of people in a confined space which is just everything i enjoyed about that map in modern warfare if you've played it um so i really hope we're gonna have two teams and it's gonna be you know a lot of infantry small spaces just absolute chaotic not as a main mode but as a fun friday afternoon let's just rank up my gun and do crazy stuff like this was an excellent part of the trailer although i will say guy up here what? So, oh you can see my mouse uh there was a wait let's just go back look at this there's a guy up here i don't know if you spotted him but he is there interesting now I've got to remember to hide my mouse. 
Sorry if I didn't hide it before. Dislike the video if it annoyed you. Now, interestingly, uh, there's a lot of interesting, interestingly, interestingly, there's a lot of different infantry customization going on here. I don't know if it's just for the trailer, but it would lead me to believe there's a lot of more, there's a lot more focus on customization, your character in the game, which I like. Like here, you've got the light on the side, uh, the armband, you know, the rucksack. I don't know if that's relevant to every person, but really cool. Oh my goodness. So good. And then so cool. And, and this is what I'm talking about. This right here. So we've got some like cool explosion going off. We've got loads of infantry on the screen. 128 players is like confirmed. I don't know if we'll get 128 players on this map. That would be insane. There's a freaking little midgy fly in my office. God damn it. Oh, it's just so cool. And then, okay, this was cool for two reasons. Number one, I love the change of color palette. Completely different. So I really like how this game seems to just take really awesome landmarks regardless of the color palette and just throw you into them so like this is some icy cold blue you know natural light infused map and it looks great and then before we had industrial cargo nighttime you know it's really cool and and it'll be nice in map rotations because you get to play lots of different types of maps oh i think i just turned on captions Okay, this... <laughs> I don't need to say anything about this. It's freaking... It's overcraft. Oh! Now the music was uh, like a beautiful choice. I, I have to say, I heard a lot of people on the internet complaining about the music choice. Screw those people. It, it worked. It was great. Okay, now you guys have probably seen this in the breakdowns you've watched, but... No. Oh, no, here they are. Penguins. If the penguins are not in the game, Jack Frags is going to be upset. So please, Dice, deliver the penguins. Now, this is pretty interesting. So we've got this like nice, interesting light bar here. Pretty futuristic. So it's in 2042, which is a little bit into the future. Um, pretty neat. It looks cool. Uh, I don't know if this is going to be useful. This like, why, why do we need a light bar on a tank? I thought tanks were meant to be stealthy. I don't know. So cool. And so this screenshot right here is what we've seen in a lot of leaks. So a lot of leaks we saw had this basically as a postcard drawn, uh, if you've been paying attention. And well, fair play to the leaks. They were spot on because we've got this rocket here. Um, I don't know how big this map is, but dude, Looks cool. We've got a tank down here for scale. In case you were wondering, we've got inventory down here. And uh, it just looks crazy. It looks like this rocket blows up or something. Really awesome to see. The big levolutions are something that I really enjoy with Battlefield. Uh, even to this day, that big... I can't remember the name of the map, but where the big tower falls down. Epic every time. I love it. Four, three... Like, look at this. Look at the infantry. There's like a hundred people down here. It's ridiculous. It's great timing here. I, I thought this was exquisitely crafted, this trailer. Honestly, really well done. Like, if the game's terrible, they've done an absolutely stellar job of faking it. Because this trailer just makes me want to play it so much. Yeah, I have to talk over the music. Look at that. This is so okay. In the brief, <laughs> I'm assuming for this game, there was hey, we gotta have a ray tracing map. This is the ray tracing map. Look, we've got so much different lights and colors. Uh, we've got lots of different materials to diffuse different colors on. We've got sand, we've got roads, we've got metal, we've got glass, we've got blue lighting, we've got pink lighting purple lighting orange it's just a it's just a rtx i don't know deep monetized looks fantastic though 
Look at this. Look, look, this is what I'm talking about. So on the helicopter here, it's going to be so fantastic to be flying around this. You get some HDR gaming. You can get some green there on the helicopter. It looks pretty cool. Oh, man. So we got the little buzzard. Genius. I love this. This is great. Oh, it's so good. Oh, man, you can... And then the music comes back. It's just a brilliantly... I just genuinely think it's impressive. As someone who makes videos, it was well... The, like, the music was timed well. And then the most iconic part of the trailer. Uh, this is obviously a throwback to one of the most epic moments in Battlefield history. And I certainly tried to replicate this. You jump out. Boom! And then climb back in. You've peaked. You've peaked. You've peaked, sir. You, you may... You've won Battlefield. Get a nice little look at the map here. Pretty cool. But, man, that, that moment, I was just like, <laughs> so cool. And we're back. It looks like on a cityscape map. And this SIB building here, I think, was in the previous thing. So that just goes to show the different lighting situations for the maps, which is just basically just more maps. It just gives it a different feel, gives it a different atmosphere. And that's pretty cool. Oh, I just... Oh, I love it. Oh, so much action, the music. And then, if you weren't already like, what? Like a million different troops in the background. And then freaking, because why not? Different vehicle there. Looks pretty cool. Tornado. What do you mean a tornado? You what? Tuk Tuk is awesome, and I've got a little Easter egg here to show you. You've probably already seen, but I'm going to show you anyway because I think it's cool. Oh, great. Oh, it's just so fantastic. Woohee! <laughs> Am I going to get to show this? Uh, maybe? Oh, wait. I'm going to have to rewind it. Now? Show me. I know. It had, if you managed to get it timed, I'm not going to waste time going back and forth, but it has the games of Battlefield in order, like 5, 1, you know, whatever. <laughs> two, 2, 0, 4, whatever. I just thought that was cool. Honestly. Honestly. Absolutely, absolutely exquisite. Um, obviously, gameplay reveal is going to be on 13th of June. The video has, as it stands, 12 million views. Very, very hyped. Although, they haven't really got their SEO together because if you scroll down here, it clearly has Battlefield 5 as the game, which is a little bit awkward. Um, but yeah, look at the like ratings. It's, like, it's almost got a million likes. Fantastic, absolutely incredible. 22,000 dislikes. I'm guessing those are people that worked on Call of Duty. I don't know. That trailer was fantastic. Best trailer I've ever seen in my life. I, it was action from start to finish. So much information in there. Callbacks to the community. I don't know what else you want in a trailer. That was fantastic. So if you want my opinion on the Battlefield 2042 official trailer, that is how you do trailers. And... Yeah, I wanted to talk about it because it's freaking awesome. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.